Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, whenever you have tuned in to watch. This is a Warren, a Lighty Collects, coming at you with another video. Um, spoiling you guys quite a bit this week. Um, so before we get on, just a brief reminder. Today is the final day to enter the members draw with the chance to win the two Mr. Men five pound coins. One ninety nine member, just uh, one ninety nine mon a month, should I say? Just click on the join now button on the YouTube channel, and that will be getting drawn at some point tomorrow. And the video will be up tomorrow. So without further ado, let's have a look and see what we've got today. Move these two out of the way. And today we have the latest in the edition of the Mary Anning collection, which is obviously the uh, dinosaur, uh, to give it the, another name. Um, and I believe pronunciation is Plesiosaurus. So apologies if it isn't, but that's what I'm calling it, Plesiosaurus. So, first impressions, yeah, it's not too bad. Um, it's an okay coin. Um, not much really to say about it, if I'm honest. Um, it looks quite a substantial beast on the picture here. But uh, yeah, so as we always do, let's open it up and have a look what um, the inside of the pack is like. So firstly over here, you have a little bit um, telling you about Mary Anning. And just briefly, um, there is a film, I believe it's out now on Amazon and a few other uh, websites. There is a film just been released called Ammonite. A-M-M-O-N-I-T-E, Ammonite. And it is a film based on um, Mary Anning. It's not so much her fossil hunting. Um, it's more based around her personal life. Um, she didn't get a great deal of recognition at the time um, for her fossil hunting. Um, and she was down in Lyme Regis in Dorset, um, basically sort of looking at fossils, collecting fossils to sell to local tourists. Um, and it's a little bit more uh, in-depth than that. But yeah, um, and it's Kate Winslet that plays Mary Anning. So be sure to check out that film. Um, I'm going to possibly watch it this afternoon and uh, I might do a review on it, we'll, we'll wait and see. But yeah, so that's just a little bit of information for anybody, um, either Mary Anning fa fans or um, would like to learn a little bit more about her. So, as we open it up, it tells you more about Mary Anning and how she got into uh, fossils and on here um, are some of the discoveries that, that she was uh, making and here we go and then some more details on there so I'm not going to read through it but if anybody wants to pause it um, and read it you're more than welcome to do so and then down at the bottom it tells us a little bit about um, the design and the designer itself I, I think this one's quite good that it's um, a paleo artist paleontologist uh, artist that has designed this I think that's quite nice, rather than just, you know, um, getting it out to anybody. 
So there we go, a little bit more information about them now. And yeah, that is pretty much it. Apart from the specifications. So what we've also got, as I do with all of the dinosaurs, um, we also have the coloured version. So I'm just going to do the same with the coloured version. We'll open that up and we'll have a look at that in a little bit more detail. I am quite biased, I must admit. Um, I do prefer the coloured version, I've got to be honest. Um, and that's the same pretty much across the board with these. Um, I have preferred the coloured version on all of them. So, yeah, let's have a look. And it feels more weighty. So let's have a look and see if it is indeed any different. Um, if my memory serves me, usually on these, don't they have a pop-up of the dinosaur? Uh, isn't that normally the difference of them? So, firstly, the back is totally blank on this one. Um, just a picture of the sea. The writing all there is exactly the same as what you have in the... Um, other one and obviously the back is the same so we'll just open it up and see ah, okay so this one I see yeah so it's the same here um, slightly different I think here and this is usually where it pops up yeah so there you go if you were to sort of house it like so you can see it's a, a pop-up of the dinosaur um, and that is pretty much the only difference slight difference on the packaging and obviously the coloration of the coin on the front so I think all in all um, I'm, I'm rather happy with that um, I don't know whether the coin was designed to come out around the same sort of time as the film or um, that's just happened because of Covid um, but I think it's quite a good little tie-in that the two of them are out at the same time. I say I don't know whether it was due to go for cinematic release or it has just gone straight onto Amazon Prime um, but if you're a member of Amazon Prime you'll be able to watch it. Um, if you're semi-decent with computers, you'll be able to find another way to watch it. Um, so yeah, so that's all there is for today. Tomorrow there will be a video announcing this month's winner of the two Mr. Men £5 coins. And until then, keep yourself safe, everybody. Love and respect to you all. And I will see you guys soon. Stay safe.